Welcome back to Let the Quran Speak. Like all young people, Muslim youth face the challenge of developing skills that can benefit themselves and the society around them. They also face an additional challenge, how to integrate and develop their own Muslim identity. MIST, or the Muslim Interscholastic Tournament, aims to develop both these goals. We went to the tournament and we spoke to some of the students there. Have a look. Amal Albaz is a student at White Oak Secondary School and a participant at MIST. MIST stands for the Muslim Interscholastic Tournament. It's a two-day competition with multiple events for Muslim high school students in the greater Toronto area. This year, the tournament takes place at York University. Participants compete in debate, art, trivia, sports, Islamic knowledge, and more. I'm here at MIST because MIST to me is honestly like a drug. Um, I joined MIST when I was in grade 9 and continued ever since. And it's completely unfortunate that it's my last year. Amal is participating in six competitions. These include spoken word, basketball, photography, and Mist Bowl, the tournament's popular quiz bowl competition. Mist is one of those competitions where you will have a talent and you will find something to do. You know, the ranges of competitions are so grand and so uh, huge that you will find something for yourself. And alhamdulillah, I find things that I can do here. And it's an amazing event to be in. They're very competitive, I'll tell you that. Um, people like go full out and like I was just at the photography competition, the pictures were amazing. The, like you, you can see the amount of time people actually put and not just taking the picture but explaining it and what it's about. And likewise in every competition, you know, um, you know for Ms. Bo Ms. Bull for example, they post the booklets like two, like a, a, about a month early and you start practicing and preparing for that whole month just for that one day or two days. So it's a nice feeling at the end to know that you did something. MIST isn't just about serious competition. One of the things that participants love about the tournament is the fact that it brings together so many young Muslims in one place. There's a sense of camaraderie, pride and unity amongst the participants. You can see and feel the excitement around you. You honestly do get, you do feel a sense of unity between everyone, not just your school, but all the other schools. You chant for each other, you be with each other. It, it is really what Islam, what Islam really is all about. Musa Jamal agrees. He's a student at the Islamic Foundation School. For me, the MIST experience is amazing. Just coming here and being a part of MIST, just, it amazes me. Because I came when I was in grade 9, and I saw how much fun everyone had, and all the competitions, and um, just the amazing spirit everyone has. I want to be a part of it. I think the best way to describe it is just when you walk in. You walk in, and you feel the vibe of just everyone's spirit, and you know that you're all one, like, you're all one community, you know, and you get to connect with everyone else and it just feels amazing to be able to do that. In addition to Mist Bowl, Musa is participating in Tajweed, which is the traditional art of chanting the Qur'an with proper rhythm and clarity. I started since I was a little kid. When I was a little kid, I started learning this and slowly going up. And I, I really got into it when I was in grade nine, when I, when I uh, did the memorization of the Quran. And uh, from then on, just like it keeps on, it keeps on improving. I used to practice every single day with my brothers because they also know uh, the Quran pretty well. And I used to call my I called my teacher yesterday night and I called him up at like 12 o'clock and I was like, you have to listen to me. I need you to. And then he listened to me and he gave me a few pointers and he was like, don't worry, you'll do great. And, you know, I hope I did. The tournament was founded 10 years ago in Houston, Texas. It expanded to Toronto in 2008. In its first year in Toronto, there were about 60 competitors. This year, there are over 750. I think this really helps kids understand that Islam can be fun. Like everyone has this notion that like you know Islam's really boring and like to be a practicing Muslim like you know you can't really do anything. But uh, like Miss allows kids to like you know you can still be a practicing Muslim and you can still have fun. You can still like um, like basically participate as a team and still get that like team spirit and stuff like that and still like in an Islamic environment. The organizers of Mist are themselves young Muslims, mainly university students and recent graduates. Asma Desai is a registration and marketing chair. She's been involved with MIST since it came to Toronto five years ago. She hopes that the tournament will help young Muslims develop leadership, communication, and other creative skills. 
The purpose of MIST is, um, for one, to bring the community together, um, and also, more importantly, just to provide a venue for the kids to excel in the different, um, just to showcase their talent. So it really provides students to, if they have a passion for art, to actually showcase it within the larger community, um, their passion, the different types of passion that they have. MIST also helps young Muslims explore their Muslim identity and make connections with fellow Muslims. And because the events are organized with Muslim principles in mind, participants feel they don't have to compromise their values while competing. Personally, like, um, especially for sports, for example, it's really difficult to be on a sports team in public school as you know, a Muslim and a, a, you, as you wear a scarf, etc. And to be here and to have this other alternative that still motivates you to become better and be with all these people, it's an amazing sensation. And it really, as I said, it really does give a sense of unity. And I made my, half my Facebook friends are from this, essentially. You just, you like, you don't know all the Muslims around you, and all the different schools around you, until you come to Miss and see, wow, we're that many, mashallah. And like, it, it's an amazing sense of unity and, and, um, and realization. For Musa, one of the benefits of MIST is that it fosters unity and teamwork amongst young Muslims. These are qualities he feels are crucial to the future success of the Muslim community in Canada. I think a lot of the problems that Muslims face are um, just uniting with one another and also being able to interact with one another on a common ground, right? And the best way to do this is just bring the youth together because the youth are our next generation and this is what MIST focuses on. It focuses on the youth, the teenagers, all the MSAs in Toronto and it brings everyone together so they know how to work together to deal with others, other problems. Ultimately, MIST helps young Muslims become young leaders citizens who can participate fully in society and who can use the skills they've gained to make an impact on those around them. You feel this like mist is where you develop yourself, where you become better. So this is like your nest where you can actually after fly away and say this is what I did, this is what I got out of mist and use that for your everyday basis, everyday life. That was MIST, the Muslim Interscholastic Tournament. For more information on their events, visit MissToronto.ca. Coming up are question and answers.